Ryan and Mary? On Friday! No, I've seen the video. <laughs> Hello and welcome to another Oxford vlog. It is the end of week four. It's Saturday. Yesterday we in Wolfson we had bonfire and fireworks night and it was so so lovely. We are about to begin week five. A uh, week five often is known as the, the week of the blues, the week five blues. Um, so it is pretty hectic for me. I have two major assignments. One is a formative essay, which means it's not marked or anything, but it's also an essay for my C course, which is going to be reviewed by my seminar leader. And she's going to advise me for my summative essay at the end of term. Like this essay is like the beginning of my bigger and what will be graded essay. So that is quite important. And then the other assignment is my proposal for my B course essay, which I think I'm on track for. I don't really know what I'm going to do for C course essay and it's due in less than a week. So... This week's going to be busy, and I hope that this vlog will show you what it's like to be an Oxford student in a busy, busy, hectic assignment week. Hello. I'm back from a hockey match. Um, I'm playing with Christchurch and St. Hughes because Wilson does not have a team. So it's been great fun. Played that match, did a little bit of training afterwards. Unfortunately, it rained, so. But I, I cycled home in the sunshine, so that was good. But in our match, we've won 4-0. So it was great fun. Uh, yeah, I'm really enjoying the college hockey here. It's really fun and casual, and it's up my street. Welcome to the kitchen. And I'm about to have a brownie that was left behind by Shivani. Shivani loves to bake and she left some of the brownie she made yesterday in the kitchen. So I'm gonna have some. Good morning! Every Monday in Mickema's term I had a 9am seminar for my B course, which is a course all about manuscripts, archives and book history. For the B course I was and I'm still now working on an essay about Barbara Pym's archives, which is actually where I was headed after this seminar. Her archives are in the Weston Library. At this point in Mickema's term I was still trying to work out exactly what my essay on Pym would be on, so here are clips of me reading through her notebooks at the Weston. I then went back to the English faculty library to check out some books on Barbara Pym to work out what I was going to write on and uh, draft some kind of draft of a proposal that was due that week. So here I am flicking through some books, very aesthetic, very dark academia, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Tuesday mornings I had my A course seminar which was a class I did not have any essays for but a lot of reading and it was a really nice course that brought all the themes of our masters together so there's a clip from that. I made a very poor decision today. I decided first of all cycle at all and then 
I saw it was raining during my class. So I was like, oh, then I'll just stay and have lunch in the faculty. But then I saw it eased off and some of my friends were going to go get lunch in Wilson. So I was like, it's fine. I'll risk it. I'll cycle back. It looks like it's eased off for, the, for a moment. Then not even that far into my cycle, it just starts pouring rain. So I finally got caught in the rain, like bad rain on my, on my cycle. Now there's a puddle here. Oh God, avoid that. But um, yeah, so I got home. Now I need to change my trousers because they're <laughs> drenched from the rain. And uh, then I'm gonna get the, the cheaper lunch at Wolfson, I guess, than it would have been at the faculty. So that's one plus out of this moment. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. That is ridiculous. My God. <laughs> Much better. Nice and dry now. Now onto a beloved spot of Wolfson, which is the dining hall. I usually eat dinner in the dining hall during the week, but today I also had some lunch there. Can swing coin as well, please? What's the image of you in your brain? You're a <laughs> Okay, guys, stop the stirring. I swear to God. Okay, anyway. Ben's very happy with that conversation right now. <laughs> I have washed up to like a bit of Peter Capaldi, mm. but <clears throat> he's back. I know, I've seen. It's crazy. I was thinking you're not colonized by the British enough. Very worried. I can't make some of you come to the world not to have colonized by the British. I just realized I'm recording this conversation. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I was like, oh yeah, I was gonna like, I was gonna put myself typing for a second just for footage, you know. Um. <laughs> Channel. Now I was put start putting beeps in. I've never had to do that before. I think I'm afraid to say what time it is for fear of judgment. So I'll leave that to you to guess what time it is. But I am in an empty library room. What's really nice about Wolfson Library is that it's often really quiet and not very busy um, and especially at night anyway because everyone has probably gone to bed. I have written roughly like 900 words of this essay and they're not fantastic but I, I'm glad I've written something down at least but a lot of work to do in the next three days. The essay I was working on the night before this was my C course essay, which was on John Wyndham, as the C course I did last term was British Literature in the Mid-Century. So after that 11am seminar, I think I first went to the Sociology Library building to get some lunch, but I think there was a fire drill happening, I can't remember, something like that, so I actually went back to the English faculty. And then after that, I walked on over to the Old Bod, or the Bodleian Library, and in the Old Bod there is the Duke Humphreys Library, which is is super pretty, super old, super cool, but you're not allowed to bring in bags or water or anything, so you have to go to this locker room and put your stuff away. I have this little coin that I like to use for the locker, it's very handy. I also use it for the Western Library. So put my stuff away, went upstairs to the Duke Humphreys room and just enjoyed the dark academia nature in there because it's, it's magical. <laughs> I then went back to Wolfson via the minibus because I didn't cycle that day. I thought I missed the bus. I did not. I was I was safe. And I went back to Wolfson for the cake hour, which is every Wednesday. It's amazing. It is cake hour at Wolfson. <laughs> it sounded so dramatic there. Oh yeah, no, yeah, no worries. Um, the World's Fair that was held. Good morning, 
it's Thursday and I have half of my essay still to write so today's gonna be a busy day and there's also free lunch in the English faculty so main plans for today are writing and food although I also have my B course proposal to do so there'll be even more writing with that because that's due tomorrow at 2 p.m. there's no due time exactly for my other essay my C course essay so I'll probably still be working on that tomorrow but I'm gonna try at least finish my B course proposal today it's only 200 words but I just want to articulate my idea well for it so that's the game plan off to the English faculty we go <laughs> another late night in the library I have one more day for this essay and it really is not I don't really have a rough draft yet so a little bit behind in where I wanted to be but that's okay it's my first essay in a while and it's formative um, but I still want to do my best so I'm gonna try and get an early morning tomorrow but tomorrow there is also a talk there's gonna be a, a bunch of readings happening by really cool authors like Lady Smith in McEwen um, in the Western Library um, in support of Salman Rushdie so that's pretty cool excited for that that's my one break tomorrow <laughs> as long as I get the essay in and then if I get the essay in by tomorrow evening and I will I will I'm gonna go to the bar in Wilson because it's a great time <laughs> at which it really began, some 32 years before anything as obvious as present as my clock-ridden, crime-stained birth. The sheet, incidentally, is stained too. The Divinity School, Harry Potter, the favorite apparently, and other things. <laughs> also, my camera is super broken. I'll show you now how in a sec. Little, we'll do a classic Claire wave, do a little pan. Claire's visiting, yay! <laughs> the Christmas market is here. Trinity College, Oxford. What do we think, Claire, of the wrong Trinity? <laughs> what is this place? Where's the Campanile? This isn't Trinity. No, no, no. no. <laughs> AI generated. Oh my god, that'd be real modern. This is 
Bali all. Where's Boris? <laughs> you should have a portrait. <laughs> anyway, hello. We saw a little bit of Lincoln, but I think it was closed. Stunning. Stunning. Cool. See what you think. I'm happy to get in here yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'll just really take this off. Why are you scared? I'm scared of old buildings. Does anything like a hole in the Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Dave, how are you? <laughs> 